back to my channel and a look at the realistic custom mod for the sims 4 and i'm excited about this because i just stumbled across this on accident when i was streaming uh the other day i was streaming uh the werewolf pack over on twitch and <laughs> i was kind of going through um some mods i don't even remember how we got on oh i remember i was showing people how to get mods in the sims and came across this one and oh my gosh i was just like completely floored so i went on and downloaded it and i was like i gotta try it so i got it in my game my first time actually looking at it so hopefully i don't fumble and mess up with it but as you guys can see it comes with a lot of stuff including a grocery store option so you could actually get things delivered to your sims house like a pack of bread pack of burger buns all this stuff here and from what I understand um, a sim will actually show up at the door I saw the picture uh, the other day while I was looking but now I don't see it but I thought a sim showed up to your door with like the groceries in hand so I'm thinking like they'll actually bring the groceries oh there we go right there so they'll bring the groceries over to your house and you could actually cook um, also from what I can see there's like some not only new foods but maybe a couple new animations or interactions because i don't think i've ever seen a sim um drink from the carton anyway and in the process of me looking at this mod i saw this cute apron was like i don't have any aprons in my game so i also went apron cc shopping i found this apron and i found another one they're accessories so whatever your sim has on they could just put that on on top of it um, so i'll show you guys that when it goes in game but if you're interested in getting this mod uh once we review it <laughs> you could just i'll put the link in the description box you're going to go to mod the sims go to download and then um download the pack here the cookie mod it was just updated july 10th so yeah hopefully it's I, that that's fairly recent so hopefully um we don't run into any issues but right now it's in my game i don't have any other mods besides mc command and the aprons that i found so that's only the mods that i have in my game but just a quick little run through it says it comes with 70 new functional items um, about 150 new objects for shopping and cooking and then there's various quality options and expiration dates and then we got craft ea recipes for new products um and so i don't even know like what that means but yeah, I'm just going to go in and go in. But if you guys want to read more information, like I said, I'll have the link in the description box. So let's go check it out in game. All right, guys, here we are in game with Danny Hayes. I don't know if this is a real um, chef or not. I grabbed her from the gallery and she just happened to have everything maxed out. So I was like, perfect. Uh, but this is the uh, apron that's on the thumbnail for the mod. So if you guys want to download it, it is a accessory item. I don't know. I guess it's a ring. Um, so it comes with all these different colors. I will say the original outfit she had on it clipped through it So just keep that in mind when you dress your sim to use this apron But I thought it was really cute and then I have this one here, which is an accessory uh, bottom apron I'll put the links for these in the description as well It comes with these different swatches and I don't know I just thought it was kind of cute just to get us a little apron because I am the type that when I'm heavy-duty cooking I definitely throw an apron on so we'll just do this one I'm not gonna lie I was digging that pink and white one so we're probably just going to do that one and get inside the game and go check it out all right guys here we are in game with our chef danny and her name is danny right for our butcher yep danny and i did also grab this lot from the gallery i think it was called celebrity chef hq and i absolutely love the kitchen it looks very chefery yeah, chef is a word. We're just going to go with it. But anyway, if you guys want information for this, I'll also link it in the description box. Uh, the whole lot is just absolutely stunning. Um, there's different floors. I don't know if this was part of like some type of competition or something, but there's different floors and different rooms. And uh, yeah, it's kind of cool because there's like the green and then there's like the blue and then upstairs there's the brown. There's like a purple. Um, and then and there's even another upstairs here for like for them to do uh, gardening and stuff. So I don't know if this is like a challenge house. It does remind me of that because there's like so much stuff going on. So um, I didn't even read the description. I literally just saw the house and was like, oh my gosh, I need it. Anyway, let's go check out the kitchen, which I just, oh, there we go. Pase, which I just lost and go check out this mod. So let's go check the phone first. I think we need to order stuff from the phone. Let's go see how we do that. Oh, here we go. Order a delivery. 
Um, I think that's the only thing that I see here. So let's go on and grab that order delivery. And then we can go on and get cooked. Because I think we need the things in order to cook the stuff. I'm pretty sure. Um, which she is a level 10 cooking skill. So we should be able to cook absolutely anything we want. Hopefully. Yeah, yeah. Let's see. All right. So we're grabbing it right now. I'm going to order some groceries. Let's see, we're going to get. All right, so order grocery delivery for 20 simoleons. All right, so we got apples, avocados, a bag of gelatin, a bag of vanillin, vanillin, vanillin. Why not just a bag of vanilla? Is it vanillin? Vanilla, bag of yeast. I'm just going to go with it, y'all. <laughs> a bag of dark chocolate, a bar of milk chocolate, a bar of white chocolate. Okay, first of all, this goes on and on and on. I don't know which ones. Okay, four packs of full cream. I'm pretty sure these are part of the mod because i don't remember ever seeing some of this stuff oh yeah pack of pork meat i mean i said pork meat meat pork stick of ham all this stuff here so what i'm probably going to do is grab everything a uh, pack of shrimps no way okay 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 pack of nori are you serious um i'm gonna be honest with you guys i don't I've, i have it's been a while since i've played with a level 10 um, sim as far as uh, cooking goes so I don't know if some of this stuff is already in the game or if this is per the mod I'm be honest with you guys like canned corn in a jar it feels like it's part of the mod but that might already be part of the game um, and then we got some baking stuff here because I feel like some of this stuff unless all of this actually you know what all of this may be for the mod even though I feel like we've definitely seen sage and stuff but they could have just added that for the mod and then, of course, all the veggies and stuff. Um, so I don't know what we need. So let's just order. Um, I'm probably going to have to cheat her um, her money here in a second. But we're just going to try to get one of everything, at least from the meat department. All right. And then go over to fish and seafood and do the same. I probably will just grab the pack of nori and the pack of shrimps. Uh, ooh, a red crawdad. Okay, grab that. Um, I don't know, a sturgeon. Like, I feel like these fish are in the game, so I don't know if we need them. So we'll just grab that. And then we got to get a bottle of olive oil, sunflower oil, a bottle of vinegar. I'm just going to grab a little bit of everything. I don't know what the recipes are, uh, so I don't know what we need. And I don't know if we need the items in order to cook them. So I'm just going to grab everything just in case. Okay, y'all, we got one of everything in the groceries. It's about 137 items that we purchased, and it's only 4,846 simoleons. So let's just go on and hit check on that. Going to make that order. I need one of everything, sir. So I know as far as the kitchen goes, there's like coffee grinds and stuff. So we do have an ice cream maker, a microwave. I don't know that we got a coffee machine, though. So I guess I don't see... I don't know if we're going to need it for any of the recipes, but let's go out here and wait for the, sh the guy to deliver the groceries because I don't think it immediately, yeah, doesn't immediately go into our pocket. So um, I'm assuming someone will come and bring the groceries to us. Oh, y'all, they actually are showing up with a bag here. Oh my gosh, she is giving me the craziest look. Look at her face like, ma'am, I'm supposed to bring it to your door. Like, what's the face for? That's like the perfect picture with that car in the background. <laughs> anyway, all right, let's grab the groceries from her. Uh, she's gonna probably knock on the door. All right, S and S delivery woman, accept delivery. All right, let's go grab it from her. And then we're gonna have like so many things in our pocket, y'all. Y'all, check out the details in this bag, though. <gasps> it says Samic and Severinka. Oh, and that's the creators. I love it. I absolutely love it. That's crazy. <laughs> all right. Let's go on and grab. Oh, she's going to bring it in. Oh. Okay. Are you going to give me my groceries, lady? Oh, oh, <gasps> no way. She just put it down. Thank you. Give a tip. I'll give her a tip of 10 simoleons. Uh, grab. No, no, no. Don't grab no yogurt. Just come over here. Is she hungry? Oh, my gosh. All right. I'll, I'll cheat her need. Girlfriend, you're going to be eating a bunch of stuff soon. So we got our grocery delivery here. I guess we'll just drag it into our inventory here. Can we do that? No. Can we just... Okay. There you go. Thank you, ma'am. Appreciate you. All right. So what do I do with this? Um, thank you for your... Sir. I don't know what to do with it. Uh, place in the world. 
That doesn't do anything. Uh-oh, y'all. We got a last exception. I'm not sure how to get anything out of it. So we just bought all the groceries, but I don't know what to get out of it. So let's check our refrigerator and see. Oh, it's not our fridge. Let's check our fridge and see if it's in there. Oh, wow. Okay, for some reason, y'all, I cannot get that bag in her inventory. I can't even get the option to unlock it. So I don't know how to do that part, but I figure what we'll try to do is just make something just to kind of like see if we get anything um different or new or just anything in general so i'm looking right here some of these are requiring dough oil any soft white cheese any fish any dough any cheese and i do feel like some of these are different because it's like glass of any sugar it says raspberry or raspberry jam um, also these as well but i think we can fix it no matter whether we have Oh, maybe not because you need stuff for these. Okay, so maybe we could fix it no matter what we have on us. Um, this one uses any chocolate, chocolate syrup or chocolate powder. So I guess let's just try to make that. For some reason, she took it upon herself to go um, <laughs> to go work out. So she's not in her clothes like how I had her before. So let's put her back in um, her chef outfit. There we go. We'll go back down and try this, um, see if it works out good for us. But yeah, I was trying to like pull the things out because I wanted to see all the items and then they're not showing up in build by mode and this bag is now floating. I can't even like do anything with it, um, but I'll try to pick it up here and do something with it. But I wanted to see all the items, you know, in this entirety. Uh, so I'm not sure what I did wrong there. All right, we'll wait and see until it comes out and see what it looks like or a chocolate pie rather. Hmm okay chocolate pie grab a serving let's see i don't know if this is something that's oh y'all it doesn't like cut it <laughs> you grab a serving but it looks exactly the same i'll order delivery and we'll just get like milk and see maybe i grabbed way too much stuff all righty so hopefully we will uh get just i just ordered a thing of milk so we're just gonna go out here and wait on it see if i can get it this time maybe i ordered way too much Guess that's a possibility. I wonder if it's gonna be the same lady. <laughs> oh, yep, it's the same lady. Unload delivery bag. So why did that happen last time? I think I ordered way too much stuff, y'all. Okay, we're not giving her no tip this time. <laughs> so it says click unload delivery bag. I guess I ordered way too much stuff. Danny has taken the contents of the bag and put it into her inventory. All right, so we got our four packs of vegetable milk. Look at that. Wow. Oat drink, all right. So can I open that and it'll be like four different? Oh, wow. Then it ends up being four different ones. No way. And then I could either drink or open it. Let's see. If we open it, then what happens? Uh, Danny has put all of the groceries into the fridge. Whatever doesn't belong in the fridge has gone into our inventory. So can I drink? I know we can drink straight from it because I saw it from the picture. Oh, okay. We're going to sit and drink from it. Okay. Okay. That's different. Did she actually take the top off? Oh, y'all. She actually took the top off. Interesting. So are the others in the fridge? Let's see. Open. Okay. Yep. It's in there. Glass is a uh, glass of vegetable milk. All right. So we're just going to put these in there too. And it expires in six days and these do not expire at all. So I'm wondering now though, if we go to cook, anything that takes vegetable milk, will it give us credit? Cause it says, oh yeah, it is giving us credit. Lactose free, cause it says glass of vegetable milk. So we're getting credit for the items as long as we have them. So let's do this since apparently you can't order everything. That's when it's gonna glitch out. So don't ever do that, right? Um, let's go do something that's gonna be a little bit different um we can do ah let's do gumbo so it says we need an onion um any fish we need three of any fish a glass of any rice and tomato paste or tomatoes so let's go on and order that and we're going to try to make that so um we're going to go in and order for another delivery oh was she still here girlfriend you about to come back just fyi all right is this done I, th I guess it's done. All right, so we'll go on and make another order. And this time we're going to order, um, what was it? Onion, three fish, glass of any rice. So what takes shrimp though? Cause we definitely ordered shrimp last time and did not. So let's go to uh, veggies and go down to onions. And how many onions did it say? I think we needed one onion 
and then we need any fish so let's go on and grab some fish we'll get catfish because you know people in louisiana love they catfish actually you know what let's get can we get like one catfish and then i don't know if shrimp is going to cons be considered fish um so let's just get yeah you know what let's just get all catfish uh, just in case it doesn't work all right and then a glass of any rice which i think is going to be under would it be like under greens where would rice be i don't even know where rice would be let's just do all and then we can just go down to rice now it's saying tomatoes or tomato paste so i'm just going to go on and grab tomatoes so we got uh, one onion i wish i could see what's in my cart but <laughs> there's no way to do it so i grabbed one onion three catfish uh two things of balsamic ross rice i think it was called and four things of potatoes so that should be it yes all right so let's go on and hit check on that oh wow she hit one note and was like singing is great <laughs> All right, let's get these. I'm gonna throw this away. All right, we're going to throw this away because I'm assuming it says contains four cups. I'm assuming it's empty. Uh, yeah, so I guess that's the only disappointing thing is that we got this, but clearly if you order everything, it just glitches. So we can't really do anything with it. But we had spent so much money on that. Ah. Anyway, all right, so we'll just wait for the lady to get here. Um, I'll just go sit here and wait for her. Wait for her to get here again. Um, now there is supposed to be a way you could actually make a grocery store and you could actually put the items in a grocery store to purchase So um, I need to see because when I went to build by mode to see if I could find the items to get um, There weren't they weren't any in build by mode so I don't know if you have to go into the debug menu and grab them or what the situation is So let's go on and accept our delivery. Okay. She's gonna go on and get it herself Poor her. She's like so desperate for uh wait. It's raining. Why are we going all the way out here? Lady, can I get my groceries? You couldn't have done it over there? So he's like, I've been over here three times a day. Oh, she is angry. So, oh, so, oh, you're just gonna throw it on the floor. Oh, really? Okay, all right. She says she ain't going in anymore. After, after I didn't tip her the last time. Yeah, you ain't getting no tip this time either. So let's go on and go up in here. All right, so we got our groceries. <laughs> let's go on. Oh, it went on and unpacked it for us. So we got four cap, three catfish, four tomatoes, onion, and then two things of rice. So let's go on and make our gumbo. I like this so far. Uh, this was funny though. I saw hamburger cake and it says any beef. I'm like, I thought it was a cake. <laughs> anyway, so it is giving us um, the option to make things basically for free based off the fact that we had groceries. Now, is it cheaper? I don't know because where's the gumbo? Uh, Cause we still have to pay a little bit of money depending upon what it is. So gumbo, is it gonna be free? We got everything we need. Where is the gumbo? Oh, it says glass of any rice. How do you get a glass of rice? Um, open. Oh, maybe we got to open it. Okay, hold on. Let's just open one. And then here we go. Let's open this up. Oh, there we go, y'all. Glass of rice. All right, does it have to be in our inventory? Let's go ahead and put everything else in there. And let's see if that works now. Cook. Oh, wait. Okay. And then go all the way down to gumbo. Let's see if that yep so now we got everything we got an onion three fish glass of any rice and tomato paste or tomatoes and it's still gonna cost us 17 simoleons i don't know how much all this stuff costs i'd have to go back and look but if it was 30 you know i guess it makes sense if not it's kind of like mm, what was the point um i'll go back and look when i make the video when i edit the video to see if that was really the case but we're grabbing everything out of here now when we opened up the rice it would have been cool i know we got limitations because it is the sims <gasps> y'all wait a minute oh my gosh if that don't look delicious y'all i want gumbo in real life sheesh this is making me really want some now in real life when you make gumbo you're going to do your roux and your roux is flour and oil basically you burn oil to a certain color not born oil you bore you burn flour to a certain color and then you add your water um and then that makes like the soupy like liquidy thing then of course you add your sausage your shrimp and your onions garlic bell peppers celery you know the holy trinity and you add everything else that you need to, with it and then uh yeah all of your meat and whatnot and that does look really good all right let's grab a serving 
I'm gonna put this away probably here in a second y'all that does look really good and she's a good cook like that's considered excellent <laughs> so the only thing I could see really is that it just kind of expands the groceries I mean the uh, recipes when I was looking at the mod I'll open up the EA recipes and if I'm not mistaken there's like uh, 20 to 20 I think it was like 24 items in there so I'm assuming 24 of the items of the of the recipes that are in the game actually have been adapted for that so i'm assuming the hamburger cake the cheese because it says curd uh, eggs portion of butter so i guess if you buy butter you'll have to like portion it out um then of course you got milk bread so i'm assuming anything that has ingredients on the side are the ones that were altered for this mod and i guess for if any reason uh we needed to make i don't know what the gelatin and stuff is for though because i haven't seen anything yet that said gelatin or vanillin any dough, a glass of any sugar, any berry, any seasoning herbs or spice, eggs, any mushroom. And I guess if you also couple this with uh, any pumpkin, okay. If you couple this with like gardening or just having your own little farm, that'd be really cool too because then you could have, um, you know, things fresh from your garden. Okay, y'all, so when you go to the bake, her level isn't high up in bake, but when you go to the bake, it does ask for some baking powder or yeast. So I'm assuming the baking option is that. So let me cheat her real quick for bacon. All right, she's been cheated for cheated to the level 10 for bacon. So yeah, almost every, oh my goodness. Almost everything for bacon needs some type of recipe, some type of uh, ingredient. So again, you don't have to, there is a mod that you have to have ingredients for whatever in order to make it. So you could always couple it with that mod and see if it'll actually, have it where you have to go grocery shopping to get the stuff because if you want to make lemon meringue pie you really will have to have lemon eggs glass of any sugar or any dough um which is kind of funny because i think you can make i saw an option to make dough or i don't know if you could buy like pre-made dough or whatever but um yeah that's actually kind of cool so baking is really extensive uh because all, all the recipes require ingredients um now let's try gourmet cooking real quick because we got cooked gourmet meal. Is she maxed out? Okay, she's maxed out on gourmet meal. So I guess the same thing would be for that. It has a couple recipes that require ingredients for that as well. Oh, there go the shrimps. Salt and pepper shrimp cocktail, any shrimps. Okay, so that's when you would get the pack of shrimps and then be able to do that recipe. So yeah, couple this with that one mod that you have to have the ingredients in order to cook anything. That This would be a, a game changer because... Um, yeah, for that very reason, because I think that's just really cool that we have. Uh... Oh, now she's getting all of these because, yeah, she was maxed out on everything. I'm surprised. Literally was maxed out on everything except for parenting. So I'm surprised she didn't have bacon. So it's kind of weird, y'all. I was trying to pull everything out the refrigerator so we can take a good look at it, like up close and personal. So here is the rice, which I think looks really good because it comes in a measuring cup and it's already measured out. And then, of course, this is the um, vegetable milk, which is kind of funny. <laughs> I don't know why I thought I bought cow's milk, but we actually bought vegetable milk. But when I go to take the pack out, um, oh, there it go. Now it's, now it's working. At first it wasn't working. Uh, so we can kind of see that up close. And then the same thing for the rice. We could take that out and see that up close too. And it actually says basmati. I never knew how to pronounce that, but it actually says that. So I don't even know if we have to put this actually up or can I just leave it on the counter like a decor item. Um, and then that way, whenever you actually open it, you can stick it in the fridge because I don't know that this expires. It's rice. So yeah, that doesn't expire. So you could just leave it out um, on the counter, I guess. But yeah, sometimes it doesn't place, which is kind of weird because I don't really have any mods in my game except for this and uh, MC Command. So I'm not sure why sometimes it's working and sometimes it's not. But you, like I said, you can put them on there and then you can open them and then get the items out that you need for it. Uh, the milk lasts for six days. Like I said, the rice doesn't have any expiration date because it hasn't been open. And then this rice is because it's rice. You don't have to worry about it spoiling at all. So that is actually really cool. Uh, another thing I saw too was the option for coffee. So I guess if we had an espresso machine, so let me go grab that real quick. I'll either get an espresso machine or a coffee machine. Okay, y'all, so for coffee, the espresso machine, it does seem to work if we do it for here. It says any coffee beans, milk or full cream. So these will not actually, there's no espresso grinder, so we must need to have an espresso grinder for it. But these actually use ingredients too. So you could do that for the coffee as well. So I'm assuming anything you order delivery for, you could actually 
use in recipes. So I'm gonna just do a little once over real quick to make sure we didn't miss anything. Oh, the ice cream machine might be a good look. Hold on, let's try that real quick. Craft ice cream, okay. Ah, any flavor? Okay, so glass of full cream, glass of any sugar, any flavor. A uh, glass of any sugar, glass of full cream. So I wonder if that's where the vanilla in it comes in. Um, any fruit for sorbet. Um, I don't know. I guess you got to be maxed out for this too. Yeah. So cho choco berry or chocolate syrup. So that is actually really cool. So baking, microwaving, coffee in, and not microwaving, <laughs> bacon, cooking on the stove, ice cream making, and looks like even here for coffee. So actually a really cool mod y'all i really like this one um i'm gonna look into seeing how it interacts with the mod that um requires you have ingredients i think that's the custom foods mod and see if that does something and if the ingredients work for that too because i know the custom foods mod it'll have different recipes and stuff as well and if it works for that too as far as um using some of these uh groceries and stuff that'll be really cool um so what would be even more cool as if it made a difference in the quality based on the ingredients you use. Like maybe if you use the more expensive stuff, it'll be um, higher quality, like more excellent as opposed to like normal. That might be really cool. We also have peanut butter and stuff too. So I wonder if you use that to make cookies or maybe you can make a sandwich with it. Oh, here go a jar of tomato paste. I was looking for it. I ended up finding tomatoes. Um, but I'm wondering if you, oh, it says contain 10 servings. So I guess you'll just 10 different times um, for the jar of tomato paste. That's actually pretty cool. Oh, then there's like TV dinners in here. Three minutes in the microwave. Let's try that real quick. Pack of baking for the microwave. Okay. Uh, we'll try those two real quick and see. But there's a lot of stuff in here, y'all. <laughs> it's her again, y'all. We're going to be best friends with the delivery lady. All right. Do I have to click the bag? Accept delivery. Okay, there we go. All right, we got our groceries. Let's unload it be asked for tip <laughs> you ten a bit. i could give you a tip lady i guess she's like i've been out here multiple times least you could do is give me a tip oh, pan and mm -hmm. it's a bag of groceries it ain't that deep all right so we got a pack of crackers um pack of baking for a microwave just two minutes in the microwave and dessert is ready and then a pack of tv dinner so let's see how do we have to actually click uh, have a quick meal. Ah, here it is right here, y'all. Wow, so they also have microwave things? Oh, wow. Microwave pastry, microwave dinner. Wow, y'all, that is so cool. I was not expecting that. It actually, I was not expecting that. That is so cool. The microwave, I was thinking like the microwave wouldn't have had any recipes, but it did. But even the microwave, y'all. So if we were to buy like a breakfast burrito, any dough and beans, we can microwave our own breakfast burrito. Same thing with the pizza and the oatmeal. That is really cool. Okay, here go a pack of crackers. We can eat a pack of it. Oh, wow, y'all. She's actually walking with it in her hands. Wow. That's really cool. Besides this bag, I still don't know what happened with this bag. That's a little bit worrying me. So, guys, if you do go into debug menu, you can see some of the items here. We got the glass of rice here. Uh, we also got the bowl of vinegar. So, let's go in here and check it out. Um, there's also the chicken filet. Uh, there's cheese, like blocks of cheese. There's all sorts of stuff. There's flour. So you could make a grocery store and just put these items out. Uh, they said it's like, I think 150 items. I don't see the box. I see like, okay, so full meat cube. I see the milk here, the cream. I don't see the rice and stuff like that, but it could be a situation, um, I have it on show all, but it could be a situation that of course you got the delivery package here, you got a bag of yeast. So yeah, that's really cool. So you go into debug menu, you can grab all this stuff. I do notice though, when you type in like debug sometimes, oh, it'll give you like multiple debugs. I don't know if these are like different 
options nah not really okay guys i got a little bit of a correction with the whole situation i went out to go see if i could find out any information about why um this wasn't working right for us and uh came back i went out the game and ended up finding more things to download oh my gosh more recipes and stuff i will put all, everything in the description box but honestly um i'm sorry actually on their Patreon page, they have more custom recipes and stuff, and they're still updating stuff as well as working on a V2 of this mod. So I'm gonna go into cook and see if it comes up, cause now there's like caviar stuff and there's more baking stuff, baking cupcakes in the oven and all sorts of stuff. Hopefully I grabbed it all because um, there was a bunch of recipes that popped up and I'm not even sure where they would be at but definitely one of them was about caviar it was like a breakfast some type of caviar breakfast some something or another i don't even remember <laughs> what it was but i was just like oh yeah oh yeah um but i grabbed that and it was like a cooking thing where you can cook more cupcakes in the oven and these are all recipes that um that i found on their patreon page Okay, y'all, I went into build by mode trying to look for those recipes and we do have a new cookbook. So I'm wondering, it says recipes download separately, but I'm wondering if we need this cookbook. So I'm just gonna go on and grab it real quick. We could actually get rid of this cause we don't really need that. So I'm just gonna put the cookbook stand. Um, what is it? Does it have to go up against the wall? It has to go up against the wall somewhere. Um, so we'll just stick it right here and put the cookbook here. I don't know if it's something that we got to interact with, but we'll try it in a second. But there's different swatches. It looks like it's one that says recipes and one that has recipes in Simlish. But we'll just do that one. I also downloaded their Tyson chicken breast and they have Tyson chicken long and then a young chicken or whatever that is. And then this one, oh, and then chocolate. Yeah, because apparently you could eat chocolate too. And there's two different kinds. Like there's white chocolate and, oh, both of them are white chocolate. Okay, I thought they were different. Um, and then of course we have, oh, oh, and then there's a bar of dark chocolate. So I did grab those from the, their Patreon as well. But what I was gonna say, which I thought was so crazy, is we got back in the game and all of a sudden this was in our inventory and now it says unload delivery bag, which I'm not mistaken, this is the first one we tried to order. <laughs> so maybe, um, I don't know, maybe it worked and it did. Oh my gosh, did it work that is crazy it definitely worked all right um so let's go in and open our refrigerator and stick all this stuff in here because we cannot use it all in here but that makes me feel better about everything because i just assumed that i broke it trying to order everything at once all right i have everything inside the refrigerator and it is quite <laughs> a bit but at least we got everything now so we're supposed to be able to eat this put it in our inventory uh the same thing with this and then as far as this goes oh look at that so we could actually cook from the cookbooks let's go try it on and see we got breakfast okay there go the caviars <laughs> i was like where's the caviar stuff so you need the cookbook in order to get the um the recipes the new recipes so this is caviar crepes that's for breakfast and uh i don't know if they're gonna add i'm assuming they'll add more recipes as time goes on but you need salmon a flour sugar and milk or egg uh the funny thing is we have flour we bought one of everything, so I'm sure we have flour and sugar, but we did only buy one salmon. We probably need to just open up the sugar and open up the flour and, and the eggs in order to get that, or we can make crepes. Uh, as far as baking, it looks like we could also bake from it. We could do carrot cake, cupcakes. Are you kidding me? Look at all these cupcakes, strawberry fizzy cupcakes, um, super chocolate, Tummer's bomb cupcakes, the baconing cupcakes. You could also bake in here too, as long as we have all the ingredients. But like I said before, I feel like that mod that requires you to have the ingredients would be really good to couple with this. So let me see, do we have a bag of flour or something? Y'all, it's so hard to see everything and it won't let me expand it. Okay, so if you put it in your inventory, you could actually open it. But this is just regular plain white rice, um, brown sugar, yeah, so you can open it. And I'm assuming that when you open it, it'll give you, um, put all the fridge. Okay, so then I'm assuming it'll give us different types of sugars. Let's go bake. And then yeah, sugar. So there you go. So it'll give you the sugar then if you open it up. So you have to open the things up. Wow, y'all, that is a lot. 
I don't know how to make custard, but I'm assuming we'd have to open that up too. And the same thing for the eggs. Nothing's in alphabetical order, so I think you have to just, let's put it in our inventory and then we'll open it up and then get the eggs out. But imagine if you were playing with like cottage living, you could go to your garden and get the eggs. I'm not your garden, go to your hens or your chicken coop and then get the eggs. Like that would be so cool. I'm glad everything smells like good lady. I just wanted you to get the eggs so we can open them up. All right, so let's open them up and then we should have, I'm assuming 10 eggs. All right, <laughs> and then we'll have the eggs, I guess that we need for that. Let's see real quick. Cook, bake. Yep, and there you go, then we have our eggs. So yeah, I don't know, and it does go down in price. They said that right now they're still tweaking the prices. So maybe in V2, when they do V2, um, it'll actually have them go down to zero. Cause if you already have the ingredients, it shouldn't cost anything. Really cool, y'all. I am excited about this mod. I think I will definitely play it and keep it in my game. There are some incompatibility issues that they list on the website and on their Patreon, on Mod The Sims and on their Patreon. So make sure you guys take pay attention to that. They do say that it works with the Custom Foods mod, and but they said it does not work with the, um, I think it was called the SCCO mod, if I remember correctly. Um, like I said, just pay attention to the link uh, the description and um but they did say that they were in talks with the creator of that mod to figure out a way to um to make it where they are compatible if that makes any sense um i think it's scco yeah i'm looking at it right there seriously sims i think it was seriously sims cooking overhaul or something like that um pretty sure that that's what it was but anyway i'm going to end this episode hopefully you guys enjoyed i kind of want to see what this looks like real quick her making these crepes uh you also could put this cookbook in your inventory and i guess if you do oh you still have to put it in the world so she still has to go to it and um i guess go do that whole little number but i'm going to end this y'all hopefully you guys enjoy uh i will have some more cooking mods uh so cases coming up soon i got a couple more that i had planned that i want to check out and i'm excited about it um uh, yeah just mod at your own risk because like i said uh, mods do change your game sometimes they <laughs> become incompatible with other mods and things of that nature so i would just be very selective about what mods you want to choose if you are doing um in my opinion if you're doing something that's centered around cooking um a sim that's a chef or you know you just want to focus on farm to garden i mean sorry farm to table type things then i would totally get this mod i think it's really really cool so anyway hope you guys enjoyed don't forget to leave a comment down below thumbs up the video and subscribe if you're new and i'll see you guys in the next one thank you so much for watching bye whoa that's different crepes with caviar that is different are you gonna feel rich eating this because it costs a pretty penny